Answers to questions Kurt is frequently asked by those who know him better than most. Why, since you are so high profile and well known in Southern California, would you risk staying here? A lot of it hasn't been by choice, thanks to LAPD, Santa Monica PD, and other crooked federal officials who make sure to have their snitch bitches rob me on an almost daily basis, sometimes multiple times a day, to make sure they get rid of as much intel they can and keep Kurt on broke ass mountain as often as possible. It doesn't matter if I pull out assets from hidden treasures or other resources, I could pull out a million dollars. When they take it, you're still out the million dollars. And there have been times I have had large, large sums of cash to leave. $10,000. Could be gone in a matter of hours before I can get to an airport, a train, or on a way to get out of town. Literally. So, when you're under a microscope like that, and surveillance like that, it makes it a little tough to move about. I've gone through multiple passports, driver's licenses, IDs, press passes, and other things to the point it seems ridiculous to carry any form of ID ever again because the odds of me keeping it longer than 30 days, unless I have it in a fucking microchip planted somewhere deep in my solar system, uh, is not real high. In the last five years, I've probably gone through more passports, credit cards, driver's licenses, and other ID than most people get in a lifetime. It's not only costly, it's fucking ridiculous. So, there's that factor. Fortunately, I'm known so well at some places, I can walk in and with a thumbprint or a signature walk out with thousands of dollars. I defy you to beat that skill. There are people who have my back. And then there are those who are a pain in my fucking ass. How's that for telling them what it is? According to our intel, most federal agencies, if not all, are on official stand down orders from the White House when it comes to concern to me in any regard of terrorism, traffic of any kind, whatever. However, we know that there are the good people in the organization, so if you give a flying fuck about the tyranny of POTUS, the most insane man on the planet today, narcissistic, even a bad actor, let's just tell it like it is. Baby again. Oh, man. I'm coming home. My baby, she wrote me a letter. Baby, wrote me a letter. Rock and roll. Looks like Savannah's losing their playground. A collection of trash on the beach. You guys having a party on the beach again? Is this remnants of home invasion part 45? Oh my god. Where's, uh, where's Savannah? Because they're cleaning her shit out right now. She's losing her playground. They're grabbing her stuff. She's either arrested or in a bathroom getting high while they're grabbing her stuff. They're going to take all her stuff. 
Well, I'm not going to stand in the way. It looks like a trash yard anyway. I mean, look at all the garbage she's got out there. Yeah, like, I, I don't know what. I, I mean, look at all the empty. Like, yeah, I don't know what I could do in this moment. I'm not. Oh, I, don't know. I think this is the best help for her. Worst case scenario, she's started a new collection of junk. I've watched her do this for the last three years now. Two, three years she's been doing this. Yeah, she'll move to a new spot and start a new trash pile. When did you want to go? Because my car's good to go. I remember the issue, so I could do buses, but with the train, somebody stole my wallet with my ID. I need to replace my ID first. You can go up to... Uh, OPCC and they'll pay to replace it right now. Okay, so that's what I'm. I'm, I'm making a deal. You know where that's at? This, Do you know I'm where no. OPC? It's at uh, Fifth and Olympic, behind the train station, along the freeway. Okay. Yeah, they get medical, food, showers, and help with Open replacement. Open what time? Four, I think. Yeah, so I'm gonna 10 do that now. today. I'm headed up that way right now. I'm gonna do that today, and then. Then we can I would jump like the to train. leave as soon as possible. Like, that's tonight the if you're ready. Yeah, yeah. Because even if you get the temporary ID, then you could go. Yeah. I, I really oh, want to avoid the Friday suit. I also have some of acid on me. Cool. So we can bring those up. Um, I'm going to try and get some food. Is there anything else I should try and get? Can you get some Yeah, I know. Right, I got a bus. Right. But, uh, yeah. Love you. Love you. I have some gifts for you if you'll ever come and see me. Clothes you might actually like that'll fit you. I got so much clothes, I can't even look. You don't have to take them now, but before I give them away to someone else and stuff, you might I even have a really nice pair of like multicolored suede women's boots. Okay, well, boots is a different story. Uh, and they're real fashionable, they're kind of like high heel boots. Okay. Uh, and it's like blue and maroon and yeah. purple, it's multicolor. Let's, I'll make a field trip so, for that. Yeah. Ozone? Uh, no, uh, and the breeze. Just walk out to the red tummy. We'll do it together. All right. Uh, that way you don't have to worry about remembering. Uh, what time do you want to try and meet? Well, see, I don't know. My priority, getting ahead on this guy, which I can pound out in an hour if he will just let me focus. Like sunset? Uh, yeah. Like this afternoon sure. in Santa sunset. Monica? We're, we're through. Sunset. Sunset at breeze. Let's meet sunset at breeze. So that'll be around 7-ish? All right, that'll be in about, uh, 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 about nine, uh, eight, nine hours. Do you have any weed with you now? If you want to sit down. some video of her in the past. Um, I will be getting out of town temporarily. Watch me. I'm good at what I do. I'm a motherfucker.